Welcome back to another round of Dead by Daylight. We're playing a killer round. It's Ghostface, and we're still playing around with what matchmaking is doing to us. Uh, let's take a quick look at his loadout. It's pretty familiar if you've watched Ghostface rounds on my channel. Nurse is calling to find injured survivors. Barbecue and Chili to find survivors after I hook somebody. Corrupt and Hex to slow the game down. When we start, the address book will give us a little bit more recovery rate to our power. The belt clip will increase the right rate in which we uh, mark somebody when we're not leaning from cover. And uh, again, this is part of our series on matchmaking and basically it's just uh, us seeing what the matchmaking system that has now been implemented actually is doing. The more games we play to see if it starts improving what has been so far a very mixed bag of survivors so uh i'm playing this on a weekend morning we are still less than a week into new matchmaking as of this recording uh there's a match that may or may not be uploaded where i played as the hillbilly who is a killer i have very rarely played on this channel's history and just in general and uh, a killer i'm not very good at and i ended up in a you know match with a, a, a pretty high ranked and when I say high ranked I mean uh, like purple red rank type of players uh, you know a very solid team and uh, you know I ended up not using my chainsaw because I was I tried early was completely ineffective uh, ended up with some 25 minute match that I still ended up 4k'ing with but I had a very very difficult what I thought lobby for somebody who's playing a killer that they never play with as we're here in Glenvale to start this match. So, uh, I just find it interesting. My lobbies have been... Oh, hi. <laughs> you didn't know I was here, did you? My lobbies with Ghostface have seemingly been very easy. <laughs> Despite the fact... I get into a locker. Oh, we thought they might have gotten a locker. We saw them over here with barbecue. Did you get this locker? Okay, just checking. We have definitely seen some locker shenanigans. Now we were really in the middle of the street, so I think we're going to get away from that. We found newer players with corrupt have tended to stay away from moving or uh, stay away from the good generators they can work on and ethically blocked waiting to get blocked. Oh no, somebody is upstairs. Wow, well, okay. they go to. Hi. I'll call that that last night's not gonna work like that. Yeah. Well, how did I miss you? Oh, that's alright, I'm still gonna down you. Should have hit you when you went over the pallet the last time. But, well, what can you do? Let's pick you up. We saw we had two Claudettes in the lobby. This is Claudette number two. Eh, let's get you up. Oh. Right. 
See you over there, Ace. Also, see you over here, Claudette. No decisive in this game, so you know. That's a bit of a issue. Missed you in that little tiny area. Oh, you're down. Oh God, Claudette, you're down. Well, these are all kinds of shenanigans going on here. This isn't even the guy I have marked. All right, well we're. Problem is, there's still a hook right down over here, right? Yep. That collect debt is dead already. Oh, you got your heel off in time. Well, nope. Where'd you go, Ace? Oh, that you're down. Your teammate is going to die soon. I'll bring you out to the end of the street. Well, this is a uh, bit of a wipeout. That's two down. Guy is marked. I just got to catch him. Where'd you go? Wait, are you actually working on the generator? <laughs> the last guy left. What are you doing? Why are you working on a generator? What are you doing? I, I, you needed to look for the hatch. You have Twitch TV. Your hatch was right here, dude. What was going on? Your hatch was right here. Why didn't you come look for the hatch? Why did you try to finish a generator? You were the last one left. Oh my God, this is insane. That was, that was ridiculously easy. And I'm a good ghost face. I'm not a great ghost face, but I'm a competent ghost face. What kind of, what kind of silliness was this? 
What kind of mount? What kind of lobby was this? <laughs> All right, I I am starting to run out of out of words to describe this. Um, when we started this matchmaking challenge, if you will, uh, we were rank some. I'd have to look back. Maybe rank nine. Maybe rank ten. And again, I mentioned we were you know we're lower. We have a, a, a worse ranking than we would if we weren't playing killers and practicing with killers that we're not all that good with and, uh, and de-pipping in some of those matches, matches that never make it to YouTube because there's not a lot of excitement in watching me flail around for 15 minutes and four people leave. Uh, you know, it's not a whole lot of fun in that necessarily. Uh, since the new matchmaking has gone into effect, however, I, like I said, I would have rounds as Ghostface where I would do very well, and a lot of those rounds made the channel. And I'd have a lot of rounds where I didn't do very well. So I, I was kind of hit and miss. Since new matchmaking went into effect, however, it has been a, it has just been a, a complete slaughter, particularly with Ghostface. And I don't understand why I keep getting lobbies like this, other than matchmaking cannot be working the way it's intended. Because that right there, that may be the easiest match I've ever had. I think I had... A couple swings and misses. I almost lost the ace briefly and couldn't and couldn't finish him when I marked him off. But this was just a complete rout. And uh, I don't even know what to say to this. This was a complete rout. And, and these ranked 20 players cannot be either very good or very long in the game. I'm guessing that ace has just started playing, which is why I guess he didn't know to, to look for the hatch. But, oh my goodness, that was... That was that was tough, and I feel bad for them. I'm not belittling these guys. These guys are are just don't belong in a lobby with somebody like myself. And considering that I'm not terribly good, that's saying something. I, that's saying uh, you know what a vast disparity there is in experience level, even from someone like myself to them. And they're not going to want to keep playing the game if they end up with matches like this, because. This is just no fun, and it's not really a lot of fun for me. It doesn't really feel like much of a challenge, so I I don't know what to do if I'm going to keep getting lobbies like this, but but this has got to be fixed, or, or something's got to be done, or something's got to kick in, because at the moment, this is just, uh, well, you saw it, that you saw what type of match we had, so... I guess we're going to keep practicing with other killers and keep seeing what exactly the game brings us. Uh, keep checking in to see how that goes. Please hit the like and subscribe button. Uh, we new, release new Dead by Daylight videos pretty much on a daily basis, and we are streaming on Twitch at Geriatric Gaming 11 there. Until the next time, thanks again, and we'll see you in the next Dead by Daylight.